Every dream starts with an idea. The belief that a single action can have an extraordinary impact. The certainty that something you do today will give people hope for tomorrow. On January 28, 2008, a 200-foot-long trailer truck snaked its way to West Philadelphia. Its cargo, a 220-ton cyclotron that is the heart of Penn Medicine's dream, the new Roberts Proton Therapy Center. Within the walls of this magnificent facility, innovative treatments will be developed. Trailblazing research will open new doors. Tumors once considered inaccessible will be targeted and treated, and patients from around the nation and around the world will discover why at Penn Medicine, the only option is every option. The Roberts Proton Therapy Center is the largest proton therapy treatment center in the world. There will be opportunities here for treatment that are not experienced any place else in the world. That opens up whole new windows for us in cancer treatment. We can now combine radiation therapy with chemotherapy and other sensitizers that we never could do before. People who have medical needs always want to know that a place like Penn will keep advancing medicine, inventing the future of medicine. We have a therapy that is not available elsewhere, that is compassionate for people, that cannot be duplicated, makes a big difference to our patients. That's why we're so proud to be at Penn Medicine. Made possible by a transformational $15 million gift from the Roberts family, the Roberts Proton Therapy Center is one of only a handful of such centers in the United States and houses technology that will revolutionize the way that Penn treats cancer. The addition of proton therapy is really about our ability to do anything we can for the patient whether it's surgery or chemotherapy or proton therapy or standard radiotherapy, it enables us to do every single thing we can um, and make choices that we couldn't previously make. By having additional tools such as proton therapy at the Roberts Proton Center, we may have the ability to take a tumor that we would not be able to cut out otherwise, have it shrink down, and then be able to remove it to hopefully cure the patient. Proton therapy is an advanced form of radiation therapy where we're able to aim the beam very precisely at a patient's tumor. And what that allows us to do is to increase the dose to the patient's tumor and spare the surrounding normal tissues. This means Penn now has the ability to treat tumors close to critical organs and the potential to retreat tumors after recurrences. The advantage of proton therapy is to target the organ that we're treating more specifically. We really think the proton adds a precision to treat tumors in difficult areas. Patients will have more effective therapy and really have fewer side effects related to the treatment. We're going to be able to achieve better rates of local control with less toxicity. Less side effects and a better overall outcome and we are really excited about that. As the world's most comprehensive proton therapy center, this 75,000 square foot facility opens up incredible research opportunities for Penn's world-class clinicians and scientists. I get a lot of questions on why you're putting such an investment in building the Roberts Proton Therapy Center. And what I tell people is there's so much potential for this treatment that we haven't met yet. This is where academic medical centers can really bring new technologies and move them forward. Do the clinical trials that need to happen and actually prove this therapy is going to be a benefit long term. What excites me about that is the ability to take the incredibly amazing aspect of targeted proton therapy and then curve it. And that's a principle that for head and neck cancer we're very excited about. Research is a really important part of Penn Medicine's mission. We plan to perform multiple clinical trials that will help us determine which patients are most appropriately treated with proton therapy. This is all about patient care. This is all about our patients. This is a unique opportunity for us that will allow us to advance cancer care around the country and potentially around the world. This is going to be an opportunity to combine our new targeted therapies for patients with melanoma with proton therapy. This is really going to revolutionize our approach to treating cancer patients. 
The center will also benefit patients from the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, with whom Penn has worked closely to develop research protocols for the treatment of pediatric cancer patients. We want to minimize the amount of radiation to growing brain, to growing bones, growing muscles, eyes, and that's why proton therapy is so great. Children will get less side effects from this therapy, they're going to have an improved outcome, and we're really excited to be able to offer it to them. Another distinguishing feature of the Roberts Proton Therapy Center is its integration into the academic medical center, something not found at all proton facilities. We made a decision here at Penn Medicine that as we developed the proton facility, we would embed it in the academic medical center so that it would be part of and not separated from the general treatment of patients with cancer. At Penn Medicine, we value the partnerships we've formed with donors such as the Roberts family. Their gift is far more than a gesture of gratitude. It's an investment in the health and well-being of our region. When my daughter and daughter-in-law were both diagnosed with cancer, there was only one place for us to go, Penn Medicine. Cancer becomes real when it affects someone you know. We learned about what was available and what wasn't for treating the disease, which is why the Roberts family is proud to support the Roberts Proton Therapy Center. It's just one more way that we can give the same hope and care that we received to patients all over the world. I've been taking care of patients with cancer for more than 20 years, and I'm the most optimistic I've ever been in our fight against cancer. I'm incredibly proud of the team that we have here. We are going to beat this disease. When you sit across the table from these very brave patients who think about and are scared about their treatment, the opportunity to offer them a treatment that has less side effects and a greater chance for cure is truly amazing. <laughs>